Welcome back friends this is Ram here and it's 47 tutorial on JavaFX 8. In this tutorial we are going to see how to get selected file path into a text area. In the last tutorial we have seen a file chooser how to choose a file one file or multiple files. Now we are going to get that file path into a text area. So this is So this is 47 tutorial on get selected file path into text area. So to do that we are going to create one text area. So private text area say text area fix the import for a text area now next we are going to declare this text area into layout so I am going to declare this before the file, file chooser so, text area equals to new text area and we are going to set the font and dimension for the text area so text area dot set font and say font dot font say sun serif comma and font size next we are going to set the prompt text so text area dot set from text and say path of selected file or files either it is one file or multiple files so next we are going to set the dimensions of the text area so dot set preferred size and say with 300 and height 50 and one more thing we are going to set this text area editable false so text area dot set such that we, we can't edit the path so editable and set this as a false now we are going to fetch the selected file path into the text area so come to the browse button on set on action method where we have commented the single file selection path so uncomment this and comment the list
now we are going to fetch the single file selection path into the text area so text area dot set text and now we are going to get the file path so file dot get absolute path into a text area now when we in the browse button action the file chooser choose the single file using a show open dialog and we are going to print that path into our text area so I am going to comment this so we will not need this try catch block now so remove try catch block save this and now we are going to we have to add this text area into the layout so I am going to add this into the fields after the browse so text area comma but now save this and run so this is the text area which we have added in our layout so now we are going to browse the path or, or we are going to choose any file and that will fetch the file path into this text area so whenever we browse the path I'm going to select any file so these are the extensions I'm going to select any or one of the file from this say javafx.jpg image now this will when we say open this it will it's going to fetch the path into a text area so this is for single file selection when we select multiple files we have to use multiple file selection so we are going to comment this and uncomment the multiple file multiple file selection now we are going to add the multiple file list into our text area so whenever we choose more than one file we are going to add those selected file into the text area so to do that we are going to send text area dot set text and we are going to use a file list so and we are going to convert this list into a string so use file or file list dot string now we are going to comment this so that we are not going to use this and remove the try catch block so whenever we choose any file or files we are going to add that files path into a text area so save this and run So I'm going to choose 
multiple files so on the desktop or files say text document image and pdf and say word document so we have selected four different documents now we are going to open this and the path of the selected files will be printed into a text area so this is the first selected jpg image the next is pdf the third one is a document and last one is a word document file unix dot so this is the tutorial about the how to get selected file path into a text area and uh, if you have any problem or question about this tutorial you can ask me in a comment section or you can mail me on my email id that is alapureram.gmail.com and finally if you really like my work please like share and subscribe to my channel thanks for watching this video see you in the next tutorial